Hey everyone, I'm Silent Core, and let's take a look at this week's update. This is one of the most epic in-game events yet, World Event 2. This is Bandos versus Armadil. The gods are having a standoff gathering resources to fuel a weapon powerful enough to kill the opposing god. Whoever wins, it's up to you. You can first of all talk to Karamir near the Falador Lodestone. She'll brief you on the situation and leave it in your hands on which god you should side with. Bandos is located next to the Goblin Village and Armadil just south of Falador. You'll want to speak to the recruiter to join the faction. You'll get a god symbol above your head so you can represent your faction and identify members of the opposing god. After joining, you'll see an interface showing the current power of each god and the total amount of renown you've earned. You'll also be given a token of fealty, which will give you 10 free teleports to your faction camp and also access to a map showing caravan locations. You can also access this map from the map inside of your faction camp. Each god will send regular convoys gathering divine energy from the area surrounding Falador. These will stop in designated areas to tap the divine energy in that area. You have the choice to either protect your own caravans or attack the opposing ones. To take down an enemy caravan, attack the guards and once they're all dead, you can destroy the caravan, earning yourself a nice healthy chunk of renown. This world event has been made even more epic than the last one, with the addition of optional PvP. You can enable this from the adventure panel or from the PvP board at your faction. Having this enabled allows you to get big renown bonuses, so I definitely recommend turning this on. Plus, killing players is pretty fun. Areas are clearly marked where PvP is enabled. You can also contribute from making use of the construction nodes. You can claim these for your own faction and build a selection of buildings. The more players helping, the faster you'll build these. Equally, if you're feeling a bit destructive, you can go ahead and focus your efforts on taking down your enemy's buildings. Strategy plays a large part of World Event 2. You can build golems upstairs in your faction tower, which will assist you in battles. And trust me, you don't want to get on the wrong side of these guys. Make use of the voting board where you can contribute towards upgrades for your faction and debilitating effects on the enemy. Also the faction strategy board. This is where you can have your say in the general battle strategy, covering four categories. The renown you earn fighting for your faction can be spent on some really nice rewards and three brand new abilities. I'll leave these for you to explore. If you want to see more of the world event, come along to our Twitch livestream at 5pm tonight. This features one of the senior game developers, Mod Maltair, giving us a director's commentary of the update. I hope to see you all there.